when I first started making YouTube videos, like I sucked at it. I just, you know, I didn't know what to say. I stumbled my words. It was just, I was just terrible. But after a hundred videos, like I started getting pretty good at it. And that was worth more than the videos. Content's good, dude. Highly recommend content. Um, to start, I've been wanting to do it for the last couple of months, but never been famous before. Um, it's the same. It's the same as like same principles as the FMS. Like you, you can talk about the services and the business and your customers and all that. But talk yeah. about it in relation to your area and become the go to expert on whatever you're talking about in your area. Yeah. I don't see a lot of that in my area. Well, there's not a lot of people doing it, especially like in the construction space. Most guys aren't big content creators, they're not doing online stuff. Yeah. Um, like I've been running a ton of ads on Twitter lately just to test it. And I don't know how many contractors use Twitter because it's not working that well. <laughs> yeah. But um homeowners are your customers. So Yeah. Like having just having content that's fairly hy hyper localized and it's it's really and my philosophy on it is you just document what you're doing. You don't have to like you don't have to teach people how remodeling works or any of that kind of stuff. Like you could just say, Hey, here's a kitchen I'm doing on Roseanne street and the houses in this area were built in the sixties. And so these are the kinds of things that these are the kind of styles that there are. And these are the kinds of issues that can happen in the foundation. And, you know, like just talk about this thing specific to the job you're working on and where it's at. Mm hmm and you can like have a YouTube video on that and mention the street that it's on and the city and all that. And then you can like run all sorts of ads for people in that neighborhood mm -hmm. to all your content that's about their neighborhood. And you're just auto, like, it's, it's almost like getting a referral. They're just like, dang, this guy knows everything about my house already. Like I should probably call him. <laughs> yeah, I would do that. But if I do that, I have to hire someone to do those jobs because it's all the way in Mill Creek. So with traffic, it takes me two hours to get there and an hour and a half to get home. Mm -hmm. so that's like three to four hours of just driving every day. That's brutal, man. It sucks, but there's a lot of money in that area. You need to get like a little uh, <laughs> a little mini travel trailer to sleep in that yeah. thing. <laughs> you could get a helicopter or something or a jetpack. <laughs> But, um, I mean, just do what you can, like, you don't have to have full production videos, like, yeah, record two minutes of footage while you're at the job and then talk about it on your way home while you're driving and just mm -hmm. post it. Like you don't even have to edit it and just yeah. start doing it. And by the time you do have more time and freedom to do it, your, your, your skill set will be a lot better. Like that's the most important thing.